King Melek summoned Mr. Grizzle again. This time, the king was furious. You wicked servant! What's up? Creative Gaming here. Today, I'm telling you another story. For this story, just imagine yourself witnessing this event. Once upon a time, there was a king named Melek who had many servants. He treated all of his servants really well. He was patient and kind to them. He was forgiving and appreciative to the hard work that his servants did for the palace and kingdom. There was a servant named Mr. Grizzle who had borrowed a lot of money. One day, the king had summoned his servant Mr. Grizzle. You owe me one million zone. How are you going to pay this debt? By the way, that is equivalent to 1.6 trillion US dollars. Mr. Grizzle dropped down on his knees in reverence. O oh, king, live forever. Have patience with me, my lord. Give me some time to repay you, your highness. And how exactly are you going to repay me? What sort of payment plan do you have in mind? I don't know, your highness. I will do anything. You do realize that I can have you imprisoned for not paying me back. How exactly are you going to pay me back? My king, live forever. What must I do? Mr. Grizzle, please stand up. I know you cannot pay this debt. I am showing you mercy and forgiveness by forgiving your debt. O oh, King, live forever. What must I do now? You must show forgiveness to others as I have just shown to you. King Melek felt a wave of compassion and he knew that Mr. Grizzle was sincere in his heart to make it right. The king had forgiven one million zone. Again, that is roughly 1.6 trillion US dollars. About a month later, Leonard, another servant of King Melek, owed Mr. Grizzle a quarter of his own. That is roughly 4,000 worth of US dollars. Leonard! Pay me back what you owe me! Please, 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 have patience with me. You could, you could put me on a payment plan, anything. Mr. Grizzle took Leonard by the neck and said, Pay me back this instant, or I will imprison you. Leonard could not pay him back, and so he was sent to prison. Kronk, another servant of King Melek, heard what happened and thought to himself, Oh, 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 I must inform King Melek immediately. King Melek summoned Mr. Grizzle again. This time, the king was furious. You wicked servant! I forgave you your debt. You put a fellow servant in prison for not paying you a quarter of a single zolan. For what you have done, you must be put in prison while working your way out of your huge debt until every single zone and a quarter on top of that is repaid. King Mele, the guards released Leonard from prison. Mr. Grizzle eventually died at the age 78, and he still didn't finish paying off his debt, and he was still in prison. 